When the TARDIS doors open on their own before it materialises, it spins out of control, and the TARDIS crew meet gigantic creatures. Are they on a planet of giants, or are they in fact reduced in size? This is my Monkey 953 coming through the ashes to your computer screens, and today I'll be reviewing Planet of Giants. It's written by Lewis Marks and directed by Mervyn Pinfield and Douglas Canfield. The Doctor and his companions find out that they have, in fact, reduced in size, and that they are now only about an inch tall. The crew stumble across a plot by a ruthless businessman called Forrester, played by Alan Tilburn, who was in Who Found Roger Rabbit. He is launching a new insecticide called DN6. However, the product is so destructive that it would kill not only those insects harmful to the agriculture, but those also vital to it. Forrester is willing to commit any crime as long as his business is flourishing. Even murder, he kills a civil servant called Arnold Farrow to ensure his business is a success. Forrester is found out as the Doctor and the crew tamper with the telephone in Forrester's assistant Smithers' lab. The exchange operator, Hilda Rouse, gets suspicious and alerts her husband, who is also a police constable, and he investigates. Uh, a small cast, but a very predictable plot. It was almost obvious that the TARDIS had reduced it in size. There wasn't on a planet of giants or anything like that, but superb acting by Alan Tilburn and the four mains. And I give this one a 7 out of 10. Okay, thank you very much for watching my review of Planet of Giants. And I look forward to seeing you at my next video. Take care. Bye bye.